Hello there and welcome to Fairyland Cottage and thanks very much for joining me here today. I'm going to share 10 things I do to keep the house smelling nice. Let's get straight into the first one being opening all the windows and if you can the doors every single day to let fresh air circulate through the house. Now I got this tip from my first ward manager I ever had when I worked in the hospitals. Every morning she had us opening the windows, no matter how cold it was, because she knew the benefit of getting fresh air in. Now I'll only do this for about 20 minutes, and if it's a cold day, they'll get closed again. The next thing I will always do is make sure that the bathroom door stays closed. Next is, we will always take off our shoes when we come into the house. I'll either store them in the cupboard or <laughs> leave them there. But the thing is, you're not bringing dirt into the house. The fourth thing I will do to make the house smell nice is to always have fresh flowers. And I'll specifically pick flowers that I know smell nice. So things like sweetly scented roses or some stargaze lilies. and it gives a very subtle but very beautiful natural smell. The idea I like to create in the house is that it smells fresh and clean. There's so many artificial chemicals out there, so it's just really nice to have a fresh smelling house. The next thing I do to keep the house smelling nice is infuse some herbs in a pot of water. Now I'll use things like spruce, pine or some rosemary. Things like rosemary and thyme if you have them growing. If not, you can use things like cloves, orange rinds, some cinnamon. And we had a particularly cold day in an Irish summer, it's not uncommon, so the fire was lit, so I just popped a bowl on top of the fire, filled it with water and added some lemon zest and the pine and the rosemary. And when it boils up and it's bubbling away, it just gives this beautiful aroma throughout the house. So it's a really simple way of getting a nice natural smell in the home. The next thing I like to do is make little sachets of lavender and I'll always add things like cloves and star anise in there as well. And what I'll do is just store these in drawers or in the wardrobe and not only do they make everything smell really beautiful, they also keep moths away. So it's a great natural way of just keeping your clothes intact. I don't really measure very strictly. I just think the more the merrier and I just go more with the smell. And these little canvas bags I just pick up as I go through the years. And I just hang it on the hangers, one or two is perfect depending on the size. The next thing I will do is I will always dry the sheets outside. Even in Ireland with loads of rain, there's still always a chance to get the sheets outside and it gives this wonderful smell. And even if you don't dry outside, just put them outside for about 10 minutes and let them get some fresh air. The next thing I do is I'll use baking soda and sprinkle it on the carpets just to get rid of any stale smells. And if you just put a little teaspoon of cinnamon into about a cup of baking soda, just helps as well to lift the smells. Sprinkle it on and leave it for about 20 minutes or so 
and then I'll hoover it up. Next thing I'll do is put any essential oil that I like onto the filter in the hoover and then as you're hoovering you're cleaning away and then there's this lovely aroma. And last but not least is a room spray. So instead of spraying all those harsh chemicals, it's really easy to make your own room spray. Just make everything wonderfully fresh. So there are my 10 tips. I would love to know any tips you have. Leave them in the comments below or over on Instagram. Thank you very much for watching. As always, have a wonderful week. Keep it simple and I'll see you in the next video.